Canada was called the chosen spot. Native Americans founded it years ago. One of the 10 Finger Lakes, Canandaigua Lake. About 10 to 11,000 people within the city. We have a school district of about 1,250 students or so. Good afternoon, Canandaigua. Your yellow limos are waiting. It's been out. Teacher of the week. Teacher of the week. Yes. This group of kids from the off season has been one of the hardest working groups of kids that we've ever had. The dynamic of the team, I think, in general, we get along great outside lacrosse, and I think that only capitalizes and continues on the field when we play. I think we know a lot of times what each other is feeling, and you know, if someone makes a mistake, I think we handle it better than another team maybe that isn't as close and as us. I think that's one of our huge advantages is our, you know our close proximity and our friendship with one another. Being at that's my senior year, excitement there at that level, you know, I'm not going to ever have a chance to play again with these guys. And so playing cross, doing something that we all love, is going to be tough saying goodbye to it. So I want to make the best of the season and make the best season for our community and have it go all the way, our, our team go all the way. Hey, Mom. Yeah. I'm taking off. Okay. Just, we're leaving at like 9.30, going to Marshalls, and then uh, probably some more. Okay, great. Uh, Have a good game. Thank you. Be safe. Thank you. You too. Have fun. You got the cookies? Yes, I do. Thanks. All right. See you tomorrow. All right. So I'm heading over to Marshalls right now. It's kind of tradition for us to get together and watch a bunch of uh, old DVDs about uh, past seasons. We watch them before Midnight Madness. It's our lacrosse preseason thing where you go play Penfield from 11 at night till about 1 in the morning. And watching the DVDs is just fun because it gets us pumped up. It shows us some of the old guys that we used to look up to, older players. And uh, it's cool to be at that level now and, you know, aspire to be like, play like them. So that's why we watch it. It gets us pumped up and excited and ready to go. Let's, let's do it up. Push from the back up. I can't believe you memorized that. Got jacked up there, but you didn't show it. You can't do that crap that Regan does with one hand. Right. He's used to being midfield. You've never been a midfielder. I'll put two hands on it. Like the homie will be happy. You say grace, please. Yeah. Hey, Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Bless us, O Lord, for these thy gifts which we are about to receive from thy bounty for Christ our Lord. Amen. And we pray for our soldiers fighting overseas that you bring them home safe and healthy, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. This is somewhere around the seventh or eighth time we've done this. What happened was Coach Rice from Penfield and I talked about it and we decided it'd be a nice thing that, you know, basketball has midnight madness and all that stuff, so we said, hey, why not lacrosse? So actually the first ones we did we're actually at midnight. We weren't at 11. You guys are playing 11, right? Right, 11 to 1. It was, uh, it was one. The first one we did was 12 to 2. And we got home kind of late, to oh, say nice. the least. But it was midnight madness. OK, everybody all set? Let's go. Feeling pretty good. It's a little late, but I can't even get up to play. <laughs> Look at what Kyle brought for good luck. <laughs> Sweet bear <I> head. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm excited. Tackman and middies. Come here, man. Get down and get at it. Throw and catch. Get the cobwebs out. Hey, have some fun. Hey, it's 11 o'clock, 11.15 oh, at night. Fun, Where would you rather be? Oh, Let's let it rip, fun. have a little fun. Brave. One, two, three, brave. Yeah. Get out there and let it rip. Here it goes. Now, you got him right there. Stay there. Stay on it. There you are. Hey. Go. 
Get up, Kyle. Get up, Kyle. Hey, go down one. Where's my ball? Go down one. Turn it back. Hey, 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 I think after like the quarter, first quarter, we got our legs under us, started moving the ball, playing with confidence, and, and I thought our offense was doing great, and our defense was doing great, communicating, and I think I'm, we're ready for the season. I'm excited. A couple practices, we'll be ready. Not bad, not bad. You know, it's a good, good chance to get our cobwebs out, go against somebody else, get a little bit of idea of what we got, and what we need to work at. Get yourselves ready to go a week from now, because we hit the ground running next Monday. This is all for fun and games, but next Monday it gets real. <laughs>